Hello everybody and welcome to this week's weekly vlog. It is three minutes past one. Um, I've just been working all morning and I'm kind of doing pretty all right with it and planning videos, things like that, trying to get a bit ahead. Um, this weekly vlog is gonna have a bit of a theme because I am desperate, first of all, to have a bit of clear out of my wardrobe. Um, now that we've like organized to stay here for another year, I desperately just need to get rid of some stuff and make it a little bit easier to stay on top of it being tidy and things. Because um, I work from home, I can't work around mess. And so if everything's really, really, really messy and out of hand, I end up just tidying during the day rather than working. So I just want to get it to a point where it's a bit easier to stay on top of it. Um, and also just be a bit more efficient so that, you know, when it's like cosy evenings in the winter and it's dark and stuff, I, I want to spend those on the sofa watching films, not on my laptop. So I want to get a little bit more efficient at things so that hopefully I can do that. Um, so I don't really know how it's going to work. I'm going to, I'm working on a video which is going to be up, so you're watching this. So it'll be up on Sunday, which is really exciting. I'm really, really looking forward to it. Um, and part of that is around having a bit of a wardrobe clear out. So that's really good because it's going to make me do it. So I've been deciding what sort of what things I'm going to get rid of and stuff like that today. Um, but other than that, I kind of going to have to do this under my own steam, but we shall see. Um, anyway, first things first, I just need to get a few more emails done and write a blog post today is the top things on the list. Hey guys, just making a coffee. It is about, I think it's nearly six o'clock now. I've had quite a productive day. I've got like nearly everything I want to get done done, which is good. Um, I'm feeling really, I just, just want to ask you all a couple of questions. Well, actually no, I'm just gonna ask you one question. How many of you read my blog? I'd be interested to know. Since I've you started YouTube, like my readership on my blog has definitely grown. Um, and my blog is like always a more of a focus on me than my YouTube because I don't, I mean, I do have a few sponsored videos coming up actually, but um, I don't really accept many sponsored video things unless they feel like a really good fit. So my blog is my income. So it's always a big focus. And I'm feeling really like frustrated with it at the moment. Um, and I just can't quite explain what it is like I just feel like I'm a bit stuck creatively and I don't know what to do to do anything diff to do something different and what I want it to be and it's bugging me a little bit so I've just been sat trying to have a brainstorm and find inspiration of different posts and things um but yeah if there's anything you ever wanted to see please just leave me a comment and let me know of like different content that you might like or what you do like or what you don't like that I blog about currently. Anyway, enough of that. Um, I am waiting for Harry to finish uni and then we are going to walk and, God, I can't speak. Right, so Harry's finishing uni, then we're going to go meet him to take some more film pictures. I kind of want to do something that's a bit dark with a flash on and see what they look like. Um, and we're also just going to nip into Selfridges because I have to get something for the next testing basics. I'm filming them as fast as I possibly can at the moment. I literally just ordered, a night, so I've spent so much money today on stuff, but I want them to, there's so many I want to do, like so many different types of boots and different types of coats and jumpers. I'm literally not going to have enough months in the winter months to get them all out. So um, I'm trying to bring all the stuff really quickly, but yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Good morning guys. I have just been out to upload a video and I'm just going to Jessup's drop off my film. Um, I plant this morning to, well, kind of today and maybe this week of all like the sorting out and organising and efficiency have been a little bit scuppered because Harry is very poorly. He's got flu. Literally just came on last night. The other day he was saying he was really like oddly cold and then last night he just suddenly was shivering one second and then sweating the next. So very flu-like. Um, so yeah, I'm just being quick and getting some medicine and dropping the film off and then getting back to him because he's really not very well. This morning didn't recognize the man in the mirror Then I laughed and asked 
said, oh silly me, that's just me Then I proceeded to brush some stranger's teeth But they were my teeth, and I was weightless Just quivering like some leaf Come in the window of a restroom I couldn't tell you what the hell it was supposed to mean But it was a Monday, no a Tuesday No Wednesday, Thursday, Friday now did a little bit of a boots trip for the poorly one oh i'm just just got some things out of my wardrobe which are here on the floor which i'm gonna sell this is for i'm working on a video with vestiaire collective which i'm really 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 excited about um and i'm gonna sell some things basically for the video i want to buy something new but I need to sell some things to buy that thing, if that makes sense. So it's quite good because it's making me get rid of stuff and be a bit ruthless. So, just selected some things. I'm just going to ring mum and see if she's got the shoe boxes for some of them at home because I think she might do. And then I might try and have a bit of a wardrobe clear out while he's down here and then move him upstairs and film down here. I'm just going to play musical chairs a little bit. Oh dear. And so now I'm just going to start trying to have a bit of a sort out so my plan with this sort out i haven't read the mary kondo's life changing magic of tidying up whatever it's called but i know it has a whole thing about starting with your sock drawer so i'm going to take that premise and start small and then take this thing bigger i guess um because sometimes i start doing stuff like this and i feel so overwhelmed and never get it done so I'm going to do like, because I want to sell a lot of stuff as well, so I'll leave a link to my Depop in the description box if any of you guys are interested. But I don't want to do, if I like go through everything, I'll have too much stuff to put online and I'll feel overwhelmed because I've never had a massive wardrobe clear out ever. So it's like the first ever big one I'm going to do. So I'm going to do it in stages. Tonight I'm just going to start with my pyjama drawer and underwear and sock drawer. So obviously none of those are going to be being sold, but there's stuff I can just put in the bin. And then tomorrow I think I'll do denim, which is going to be a pretty hefty one. And then kind of clear it out, put it all online, all in the same go, rather than clear out and have tons to put online at once, so do it in bits. So let's start with the sock and underwear drawer. And I was weightless, just quivering like some leaf come in the window of a restroom. I couldn't tell you what the hell it was supposed to mean, but it was a Monday, no a Tuesday, no Wednesday, Thursday. Friday, then Saturday came around and I said, who's this stupid clown blocking the bathroom sink? Just had dinner and now on to the bottom of the drawer, which is like pajamas. Look out. Sort this one. Harry's feeling much better if you're interested. Yeah, much better. It was like a very odd, so flu-like this morning, but because it's kind of got better so quickly, it can't have been flu, so I don't know what it was, but all is good. Hello. Hello. Hi. Some people are shooting on the road, and whenever I see someone else shooting in Manchester, I'm like, no, I'm the person that stands and takes photos on the street. Back off. Um, but we have been shooting this morning, shot a blog post at H&M with the lady in it, which will be on the blog already, so I'll leave a link to it below because I think it's going to be interesting. We talk about her career and what it means to be a successful lady in today's modern age. So, just on our way out to shoot another outfit and then I've got lots to do this afternoon. I'm hoping to get it done so I can start, continue with the wardrobe clear out this evening and finish in time for Bake Off. That's today's goal. Finish everything at eight o'clock. Wish me luck. Hello. Just got back in, shot the second outfit of the day. So this is what the to-do list is looking like. 
and we're going to give it a bit of a time constraint and I'm going to let you all know if I get things done in the time. So it's 10 to 3 now, let's call it 3 o'clock. So I have to edit all the pictures of me and mum for the H&M post that I took this morning and get them in a blog post and sent off to preview. I want to have done that by 4pm. The next thing I have to do is, uh, what shall I do next? I'm kind of feeling a little bit sweaty. So the next thing I will do then is film the outro of Testing Basics, which I want to have done by 4.30. Then the next thing I'm gonna do is edit the photos for tomorrow's post which I want to have done by 5.15, 45 minutes to do that. Then I need to write tomorrow's post, which I want to have done by 5.45. Then what I have to do is, then what do I need to do? Print out images for a mood board and get all the images together, which is probably, let's say, 6.30 for that because that is quite a job. I'm gonna leave that there for now. Let's see if we've got all that done by 6.30 and then I can take an hour and a half to empty out the jeans section of the wardrobe and be sat down watching Bake Off by eight. I feel this is ambitious. I'm gonna start now. We just sent the H&M post off and it's five o'clock. I'm all hour behind. I was hoping to have filmed something by now as well. And I've remembered something else I have to do. I need to go out and pick something up. She's just like, so flipping annoying. I don't know. Ugh, it took me so much longer than I hoped it would. Anyway, let me decide what to do next now. I need to nip to a shop to get a present for somebody. And I also need to pick up a parcel. And I don't think the parcel's there yet. So that one might have to wait. So I just nipped out and we've done that. And I'm gonna have to review the list for today because I can't get it all done. And I think what I'm gonna do is do my testing basics outro filming thing tomorrow morning because my makeup's half off now. I have to try on, um, sorry, just a second. I have to try on all of the jumpers again. And I can't, and obviously they're like, take your makeup off when you do it as well. So I'll do that in the morning. And instead now I'm going to, um what we're gonna do i'm gonna edit the other photos that i needed to do and then i'm gonna have a tidy up in here because there are stuff everywhere and then i don't know what time it is what time is it? it's 10 to 6 and then do the wardrobe clear out and then do finding the other thing that i had to do i'm gonna do in front of the bake-off but not bad the h&m thing just took longer than planned everything's going wrong the second lot of pictures we took i don't like and I'm not happy enough with them to put them on the blog. So I don't have a post for tomorrow, but I'd rather not post than not have put something up I'm really not happy with. So okay, so that's ticked off the list. Don't have to do that now. Silver linings. Um I may as well have a bit of a tidy up. jeans that's not excessive and I'm gonna sell 15 of them which I'm willing to let go really who even needs 30 pairs of jeans I don't know but I seem to think that I do and I'm just gonna light some candles and bake offs on in about 20 minutes making myself some soup because I'm glamorous and that's that oh my god I'm getting rained on I've just been to see Laura at Larry Duke we had a little meeting and went for some lunch Manchester. We're going to be resuming with the to-do list this afternoon, which mostly consists of editing a video and filming another one. I think it's like nearly two o'clock, so I should be home. But three, I need to go to the supermarket. Oh, 
Hello everybody, I'm back at my desk right now and I've just finished editing my testing basics. I have to watch through it one more time because it's like they're always over 20 minutes long. Obviously that takes at least 20 minutes. I don't have 20 minutes right now to do it because the other thing that I need to do is I have to go pick up two parcels for the next testing basics. One of which has been delivered to a shop in the Ardell Centre and another has been delivered to a shop on Piccadilly. So I want to go both to those places. I have to send off some a piece of the Gucci shoes that you're just here that I sold on Vestiaire as part of my beginning of my wardrobe clear out thing. So those are sold, I need to send those off. I also sold something on Depop this morning, which I'm gonna go and send as well. Haven't yet listed everything on Depop. Um, hopefully by the time you're watching, I will have started doing that. So if you're interested in buying stuff, all the high street stuff's gonna be on Depop. High end things are all gonna be on Vestiaire Collective and I'll leave links for stuff. So that's what I need to go and do, essentially. Um, post office and pick up parcels and then I'm gonna get back and then come back and we're gonna film the mood board section for the vestiaire collective video that I'm working on which I mentioned um, and I'm gonna wash the jeans I want to sell as well uh, and watch this through one more time export it and I'm gonna get up super early tomorrow to go to the cafe to get there for like half seven and get hopefully get this online as close to 8 a.m. as possible Oh my gosh, I'm feeling kind of on top of things ish, 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 we shall see. But really now I need to just go out and do the parcel things, which is just kind of traipsing around town and isn't desperately fun. First stop is going to be the, the shop near Piccadilly with a parcel waiting for me. So let's do that one. And then next one is gonna be post office to get rid of parcels, then another shop to get rid of a different parcel, and then the final shop to pick up a parcel. Let's go. Got the first parcel. Now, post office. Back in now with my comfies on and just printing out some pictures for my mood board. I'm just make myself some dinner. And then I'm gonna do the mood board and then list some things on Depop this evening with like the TV on in the background and just do some emails and stuff like that. Um, I'm feeling like, I was hoping this vlog would be sort of about being more efficient and I've just not been efficient. I don't feel at all this week. Like I don't feel on top of things. Really, and it's so frustrating, but such is life. Everything is going wrong. Oh, how good is this outfit as well? Mm, one of my best. I didn't finish my mood board. I finished editing my, one of my videos, the testing basics. I didn't finish my mood board because my printer ran out of ink and I thought I had more in the drawer and I don't. So I have to get that in the morning and do that tomorrow. And I don't know. I don't know. Everything is just one of those days, one of those weeks. I feel like I'm being so slow with everything. Like nothing, everything's being pushed back a day the whole time. And I was so hoping this vlog would be about efficiency. But really, it's just been a week of watching someone attempt to be efficient and fail miserably. <sighs> anyway, I'm just going to pop all this stuff away. I've started listing things on Depop though, so that's good. There's just a lot of them that I need to take pictures of with me on. Um, and... Um, oh, there's stuff everywhere again. And yeah, at least I've done that. I'm just going to go take my makeup off and then get into bed, I think. Hopefully tomorrow will be a more efficient day. There is still one more day left in this working week. We can hope, can't we? Just uploading my video. Got my delicious breakfast, my coffee. Everything is going to plan so far. I'm just going to PC World to get to some French drink. And I can finish my mood board. I'm in a very good mood today. I think it's because this is my favourite kind of weather where it's cold but sunny and crisp. I just can't ask for better weather than this. It's the best. That just cost me £30 for some ink. Printer ink has always been dead like robbery. It's just insanely expensive. And the last thing you want to spend your money on as well. Being a grown up is just sometimes so not fun. Hi guys, I'm doing something quite strange this evening. At least I think it's strange. Harry's going to watch Blossoms with Chris. And I don't want to sit in on my own. And just decided I want to go see Bridget Jones. So I'm going to go to the cinema with no makeup on. 
on a Friday night on my own, as one does. So that's that. Back from our little solo makeup free cinema trip, Bridget Jones was suitably crap, really. There was like two points that made me laugh, and the rest weren't really that good. Um, but I enjoyed going to the cinema on my own, it was quite therapeutic. And now I've just been organising this pile of clothes over here because I'm shooting with Paul the film photographer tomorrow. Meeting him at half nine so I was just making sure I've got my outfits planned. And now I'm going to jump in the shower, wash my hair, shave my legs, all that glamorous kind of a thing. Um, yeah, that's it. Then go to bed pretty much so I'll see you all again in the morning. Oh my god guys, I've never been this bad at vlogging before. It's like quarter past seven. You couldn't tell I've just woken up from a nap. I um, didn't get to sleep until 4am last night. She's just so not like me. I'm really usually a very good sleeper. Um, and I just couldn't sleep. And then I was up at 7. And shooting with Paul all day. And I literally got back from doing that. And just lay on top of the bed and fell asleep. For like two hours. And now it's Alex and Nell's birthday tonight and we're going out and Harry's working till 11. It's so cold in the flat. It's dark and I just woke up. You only wake up from a nap and you're like, oh, oh, where am I? It's just like that. I need to shut this window just a sec. Oh my gosh, like I've rubbed all my makeup off. I need to make some tea, a cup of tea and sort the dishwasher out and then get ready to go out. Oh my God, so weird. So, so weird. I woke up just so sorry and I can't believe I just fell asleep. All right, we need to get ready. Come on, guys, let's go. Rally round. I've got my tea. Oh, <laughs> oh God, I feel awful. I'm going to go wash my face now. Let's see if we can freshen up a bit. my makeup in the dark, half asleep, but we're here. I think we should quickly show my outfit. Actually, I've not put my shoes on, so I'll show you just pop my shoes on. It's half eight. Okay, guys, this is my outfit, which you can't really see at all. I've got on a sheer turtleneck top, which is from Jigsaw. It's kind of not a turtleneck, actually, it's just a high neck. And then this cropped jacket is new. It's from Lara Du, and I love it. I think it's so flattering the way it sticks out because it makes you look skinnier over your tush and around your waist and stuff. And then I've got on my ASOS jeans and the Zara green boots. And that's me. Kind of simple, but I like it. I like it all the same. Let's go out. Hello, everybody. We've just been for a bit of brunch, a bit of Sunday brunch. And now we are nipping out to pick up parcels, get really exciting things like drain cleaner. Don't you wish you lived on life? <laughs> um, yes, yeah, so that's what we're doing. And then Harry's got two gigs tonight, um, which I'm not going to because they're in two different places, so I'll just be in the way mostly. So I've seen us before very recently. Seen before very recently. But Mum's coming to sleep over tonight because Mum and I shoot tomorrow early in the morning, so she's coming to stay over. So I'm having a girly night with me, man. Across the cross. And that's the plan for the day. It's a beautiful day in Manchester. Yeah. It's an absolutely it's beautiful, day beautiful. Yeah. Can you tell me what you think a candle called All Is Bright would smell like? Oh. What 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 yeah. fragrances all would you expect in All Is Bright? I'm gonna, I'm gonna imagine it's, Do you want me to smell it and then think, I'll Yeah, I think it's gonna be vanilla in it. A bit of like um star anise sort of thing. Um, I think it's gonna smell like four of the old women. Maybe. Because it is supposed to be a Christmas one, so. Ooh, I don't even know how to describe it smells that. Like, it smells like ass. Oh. <laughs> All smells like subtle. a toilet cleaner. It does. It smells yeah. like 
So all, all is bright, smells review. like duck toilet gum. <laughs> Should I just do another one? Yeah, every million oats. Well, that one, no, that one's, e that's too easy, because it... Is it, though? Do yeah. You know what oat smells like? Or? Yeah, kind of... Or well, I, I don't. My serenity. Serenity? Is that how you say that word? I think, yeah, I, I think it's definitely citrus. Yeah, well, the yellowness... Can you hold this? Gives it away. Let's see. I'm expecting something. I think it's going to be quite, quite... Can you smell it from there? What does it smell? It smells like just with all the they feel like you're inhaling like chemicals. Pure it's like when you drink um that Robinson's juice without putting water in. Oh, That's yeah. what it, you know what I mean? It feels like <laughs> yeah. the smell of Too concentrated. <laughs> what does that one smell like? That, that pearly citrus. Let me smell. Pearly lemon. It doesn't really oh, smell. Jesus. Oh, oh God, it's nothing you, natural. Slap you in the face, wouldn't nothing it? You went natural. to someone's house with that one. Oh it would. Would. Right, put that it back. Come nonsense. on, stop messing around. Come on now, I need a wee. Stop it. Hey guys, it's ten past three. Just filmed the intro of the video and put some more things online to sell. So we've now got on my Depop jeans, half of the jumpers I want to sell, and jackets. I've basically sold things I don't have to iron in order to take a picture of because next I'm going to have to move on to like trousers, dresses, shirts, tops that aren't like jumpers and stuff and whatever. Um, I have to iron those, so that's why I've been putting that one off. So I might do that later in the week and I need to put a few more pairs of designer shoes on Vestia Collective as well. But my mum's gonna be here in a little, little bit under an hour, so I'm just gonna sort out the living room a bit, take the bins down. I wanted to hoover, I wanted to clean. Alas, it hasn't been done, as is often the way. So yeah. Just got into bed. I've got my hoodie on because it's really, really cold. It's going to be heating season soon. I don't know why I smell like that. Paying for heating isn't fun. Um, but yeah, Mum and I went out for some dinner and we just watched TV. We watched the Louis Theroux Jimmy Savile documentary. It was quite good. I'm a Louis Theroux fan. Oh, excuse me. Okay, so I'm going to go to sleep. Thank you very, very much for watching this week's weekly vlog. I hope you've enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one.